Dr. Abbott? Dr. Abbott, regarding the overdose patient I just brought in, we administered Narcan, which brought her back just in time, but her breathing is still unstable. Yeah, just keep her on oxygen for now. I am, but her breathing rhythm is irregular. She's tachypnic and tachycardic. There might be something else at play here. Mm-hmm, just give her a minute. I've given her a minute. I've been observing her breathing since we found her down. She might need to be intubated. Your nurses are with her now. They're sharing the same concerns as me. I'm sure she'll be fine. She could be having an adverse reaction to the Narcan, like pulmonary edema. She's wheezing. It sounds like this fluid in her lungs. Her heart rate's in the 140s. Don't you think we should move her to the trauma bay? <sighs> Look, another overdose is the least of my worries. I'm more concerned about a cardiac arrest that'll be here in less than 10 minutes. In 10 minutes? Well, you have a patient who could be dying here now. Doesn't matter that she overdosed, she's still a mother. Yeah, a mother with enough money for drugs that landed her in the ER. And you think that means that you don't have to take a look at her? I looked at her when you wheeled her in, and I know she just needs some oxygen. She's been here before for the same reasons. Do you know what happens to three children under the age of 10 if their mother dies of an accidental overdose? Because my team and your colleagues will gladly intubate her right here, right now, if you won't carry out your due diligence of tending to a sick patient. And trust me, your nurses are on my side regarding this situation. Okay. Fine. 